Students with dyslexia, that's the focus of two Senate education hearings in Louisiana today. Some numbers show as many as one in five struggle with dyslexia. WDSU reporter Casey Fran is at UNO with what U.S. Senator Bill Cassidy says needs to be done to help children sooner. Senator Bill Cassidy has personally worked to get legislation passed to benefit with dyslexia and also spread awareness about this learning disorder. Today, Senator Cassidy chaired two Senate education hearings in New Orleans and Baton Rouge discussing the developmental perspective on testing for dyslexia. Panelists included doctors and professors with backgrounds in learning development and learning disorders and a New Orleans actor who struggled with dyslexia growing up. Those with dyslexia have difficulty reading fluently and with accurate comprehension despite normal or above normal intelligence. Senator Cassidy has spoken openly about his and his wife's frustration in finding educational programs for their own daughter who was diagnosed with dyslexia. They eventually created a charter school in Baton Rouge that specializes in programming devoted to children with dyslexia. My perspective, we should be screening all first graders uh, to see if they are dyslexic. Once you've identified them as dyslexic, you put in a scientific-based curriculum, because there is such, which would address it. And dyslexia affects about 20% of our population, making it the most common reading disorder.